Oh, right. Welcome back, my dear student. So we are making a good progress on our simple minimalistic website. All right. And we're going to be targeting our about page really soon and our contact page, which we're going to be using some um, PHP. All right. If you don't know PHP, uh, basically PHP is used to build dynamic websites. All right. Uh, everything out there is using PHP right now. All right. It's the best way to go. Now, also JavaScript. We're going to do a little JavaScript in this course, maybe later on some future lessons. But just keep in mind that if you want to become a web designer, web developer, you need HTML, you need JavaScript, and you need PHP. And I have those courses available if you want to look at them in my profile. All right. But anyway, let's work with this real quick and let's get it going. All right. So first I want to take the duplicate of my name here and I want to separate this with some type of uh, line all right and then I want to style this so what if why don't we just start with the top right from top to bottom so let's play around with that so let's go to index and we have this link right here let's just give it a class here so we can style it and let's call it title link or link title and for those of you that are now coding with me I got thumbs down for you you need to be coding if you want to get better there's no way around it by looking at it you're not gonna get better you're not gonna get practice all right anyway let's just make this smaller right here so link title and for those of you that are following me coding great job you're doing really awesome this is the way to go that means that you in the next courses you're gonna be practicing and getting better as well So let's go to styles real quick and let's put this on top all right, so the first thing that we want to do with that anchor tag is take the underline out. And the next thing is maybe changing the font size to 24 pixels. I like that number. Save it. Let's look at it. And the way the reason why it did not change is because we probably have not saved our index. As you can see right here, little circle. Save it. And then there we go all right that looks a lot better right all right so we might want to change the color also as well of that link to uh, something more neutral all right so let's go to styles real quick and let's just change that to I don't know what about 444 for now there we go all right, perfect. Let's work with it, the footer right now. Du, 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 du. All right, let's go to end it real quick. Let's take out this duplicate of my name. We probably don't have it, but I do. Let's create an, a, span a span tag right here. Let's actually give it a class as well. Separator. Hopefully I'm spelling it right. There we go. And I'm just going to put a pipe here that is located above your enter uh, key, uh, keyboard key. All right, right above the pipe, and you create that with a shift. That's a backslash. So you have the backslash, but you press shift and the, the backslash, and you get that pipe. Some of you probably don't have it because you, uh, you have it, but you have it in another place because you have a keyboard from another country or something so if we refresh we can see that pipe there but it's dark and you can barely see it so let's style it a little bit and all the way in the bottom here that's fine close to the footer separator you want to keep items that are close in the index close here in the styles as well all right so Let's give it a color of white. And if you're doing styles with six characters, right, six word uh, numbers, uh, the colors, make sure that you keep that same convention all the way through your styles. You don't want to be, you know, using different different stuff. And if you see me using different stuff, uh, disregard that. I do that because I want to show you different ways of doing it. All right. Let's do font size. Let's make it small I think 11 pixels should do it save it come back here 
and as you can see the line changed a little bit there let's go to our index real quick and let's just put that together a little bit that looks a little better right as you can see you can make this look really awesome all right now I'm gonna leave this like this for now but on the next lecture I want to work with an image here all right all right so thank you so much and I'll see you in the next lecture bye bye